everybody and welcome back to another amazing thrifty thursday this was amazing but what we found on the way home is even more worth for you to watch i'm gonna go hang this up it looks like it's gonna rain but i don't think it's supposed to rain till tomorrow that's the only thing when you're living mostly off-grid is you have to do work when you have to do it. In other words, I can't throw things in the dryer. I can't do things like that. Everything is based on the weather. High solar days is when we run all of our solar units to charge them up. That way on days when there's no sun, we use them. If that makes any sense to all of you. Okay, let me go hang this up. All right, we got that done. Now I need to go clean out the sink and then we'll work on our thrifty thing. A little spending this time because there were some things that well I just really could use now as you've seen in all of my videos I have grandma Fanny's very old canner and this one isn't the greatest but for five dollars this one sure is a lot better than what I had all right so we are going to get right into the video and first of all it's the canner this is a water bath canner and I will be using this really, really soon. But let's open it up and see what we got. I did buy a few books. Now these books were half off and I got this one, the Williamsburg, Virginia. And this one is the herb book. They had the cookbook, but the recipes were so unusual and things that I would never make. So I decided just to go with the herb cookbook because I have lots and lots of herbs. Then I got this Kitchen Aid cookbook. Reason why is because they had a lot of recipes for making breads and noodles. And as you know, I use my Kitchen Aid quite a bit. This one is an older one, but I just love it. And then I'll show you what I got. These were half off too. The red tags were half off this week. So I got two of these and they were a dollar each. Now these are pillowcases, I think. Yes, they are pillowcases. Can you believe back in the day how beautiful things were sewn? They are pillowcases and they match. So it is the birds. Gorgeous, I love it. Oh, it's so, so pretty. I really like that. So I did get a set of two of them. I'm not going to use them for pillowcases though. Absolutely gorgeous. So these were basically just printed on. They were not sewn, but I assume the bottom was sewn. And then for 50 cents, I got this. And this is going to be used for some of my seed packets. I just thought it was gorgeous. 
it comes from Holland very pretty I love the picture on it I'm gonna take the price tag and I'm gonna leave it out here for now because I am going to be working on my own seed packets which I'm so behind in all of that that should have been done a couple weeks ago but I'm going to keep that in here for now simply because I'm going to be using it just love my rooms that I'm in all right so I paid 50 cents for this it's just one napkin maybe next week they'll have more of them but as you know it's gingham it's very cute so I'm gonna actually put that right here I'll show you in a minute all right for three dollars and fifty cents I got this I think I know what it is but I know I don't know what it is okay let me change that I think I know what this is it's for the refrigerator right but maybe not can somebody tell me what they used this for so this is agateware, I think. It's porcelain. And then this is the top of it. Can somebody tell me what this was used for? I thought it was to put in the refrigerator. I could be really, really wrong with that. So I got that. And then I got these. Now, you guys will be like, why did you buy them? Because you make them. Because I thought they were so cute. And I never made them with the string on the bottom. So they were 50 cents each. And you may, I made these back in the spring, but these are a lot prettier than the ones I made. A lot prettier. So I got these and I am gonna go ahead and put them in with all of my herbs over in the other porch. But I never thought about using this twine to use that. That's, that's gorgeous. So there is my Thrifty Thursday find, but I got something for free that is absolutely adorable. So, Hubby's the one who said it. There was a whole bunch of things setting out and it had price tags on it. And he said, isn't there something there for free? And I'm like, no, they want $20. He said, I think I saw a free sign. So we turned around and he was right. It's something very old and I need your help with it. So while I take these price tags off because I'm gonna put these with my herbs right away, I'm gonna show you what I got and I'm gonna clean it up really good and well you'll have to see here in just a minute all right are you ready to see what I got for free well here it is ta-da all right this is what we got for free but I need your help I really need your help okay look so we thought this is one of these potty seats because look how it is. This is what we thought. We thought it's one of them potty seats, but it's not a potty seat because there's a bar right here. So this can't be a potty seat because there's a bar here. There's nowhere for the, I don't think there's nowhere for it to fit. So was this caned here and then they changed it. Now it is, it has, I see there is a little break in it, but we can fix that. All the nose of wood was so dry. It's just, taken all of this oil it just was so dry it was neglected for a long time that's for sure it found a home with me I love it There's the time. And the mint. La 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 Hey, 
and there is the chair. I absolutely love it.